name is Camila Thompson, founder of Envision Youth Services, which is a nonprofit mentoring program for at risk and underserved youth, ages 13 to 18. We conduct workshops on financial literacy, independent thinking, practical life skills, gang intervention, and much, much more. Hi there, my name is Elizabeth Fraser. And hi, I'm Corey Freelich, and we are with Surge Bay Area, showing up for racial justice. Through community organizing, mobilizing, and education, Surge moves white people to be part of a multiracial majority for justice with passion and accountability. Hi everyone, my name is Tanya. I'm the founder of Project Colombia in Long Beach, California. Our mission is to support the reintegration of formerly incarcerated back into society, to educate on the struggles and the collateral consequences endured by formerly incarcerated, and also to provide opportunities for reintegration through our ambassadorship program. We share different experiences while challenging each other's strategies and always stay committed to building a world without walls. Since joining Curve, we've been able to send delegations to Sacramento, written letters and action alerts, mobilized people to support legislation, done district visits here in the Bay Area, and really just learned a lot about the policy process um, from Curve, specifically around legislation that Curve has backed, like uh, bail reform, the RISE Act, and others. Uh, but we've also been able to meet amazing friends and new allies and develop relationships with them. One that sticks out to me is Initiate Justice, and we're so excited to be supporting their ballot initiative, the Voting Restoration and Democracy Act, which will restore voting rights to folks who are incarcerated and on parole. We are so excited to be new members of the Curb Coalition. As directly impacted people, we desire closer involvement in budget and legislative advocacy so that we can strengthen the voices of formerly incarcerated and systems impacted people. Collectively, we can create an impact and continue to advocate for equity, and most importantly, humanizing all in our community. We are super excited for the partnership that we have with Kerr. A lot of the youth that we work with are directly affected by incarceration. None of this work would have been possible without Curve. It is an essential organization pushing for and winning huge legislative victories in California. And we are so proud to be part of that work and coalition. Curb is a political home for many of us, and we look forward to dismantling the prison industrial complex together. So as the year comes to an end, we really hope that everyone will consider giving as generously as possible to Curb. I know our work wouldn't have been possible without them. Uh, amazing mentorship from this organization, and we're so excited for everything that's to come in 2018. Happy holidays. Thank you, Curb, for this opportunity to do great work in the community. Thanks for supporting Curb. Let's continue to build together in community and solidarity.